All right, here it is. The Dodge Charger Hellcat. Extreme Limo X25. Do a quick video on the amenities of the vehicle. Of course, your legendary orange X on the vehicle for Extreme Limo. Have one in Columbus and Cincinnati. This one has the Columbus phone number. It's got the neon lighting underneath. The low profile rims. It's a flat black, so you don't see the shine. Go to the front. All right, we'll go into the driver's seating area. Get everything started up for the back. One thing I do like about this, one of the things I like about it, all the amenities are the same as the bus. They're all controlled the same way by the touch screen. And then the seat, it's a wrap-around seat. Periscope steering wheel pulls in and out and up and down. Push button start because it has all your new cars with the key fob. So let's get inside and get things Here's the dash, all digital, except for the part of the uh, RPMs and the, the mileage. You still have a digital readout for the mileage. All right. Now, just like the buses, everything is controlled by touchscreen. This is the main screen. There we go. So you control everything from here when it comes to lighting. So we'll turn the lights on. Start it on the show. Fly optics. If it's highlighted blue, it's on. Turn the bar lights on. There we go. This button raises and lowers the partition. There's just a temperature back there because it says it's 92 degrees. Let's see if we can't make some adjustments here. So we'll go to the thermostat to the thermometer. Just like your house thermostat. You can adjust it. So we're gonna go to cool auto. Here the AC kick on. So I got it coming down to 71 degrees. Once it comes to it goes down to 71 degrees, it kicks off. It's above 71 kicks back on just like your home thermostat but I'll tell you what we're gonna take it lower than that we're gonna take it about 67 because the sun on that flat black will get it pretty warm pretty quick all right that's how you set the thermostat just like your house and next we're gonna turn the radio on again it's highlighted blue it's on the radio is the little star there thermostat radio main menu which takes care of all the lights and you can still move the temperature up and down right here for quick adjustments and then you've got the settings we can dim the screen brightness and stuff you don't really want to mess with 
change the temperature from Fahrenheit to Celsius. All right. Go back up to the home screen. And then here you have a quick reference for interior lights. AC and heat turn on and off quickly. All right, so this is in the driver's compartment just to the right of the driver. So now we'll go to the back. So, instead of a carpeted floor, you have a linoleum floor. Nice, and you got the little opening, which I'll show you up here in a minute. And then you got back in the, back here, touch screen, this is the stereo. Alright, so, we've got a main menu, and, actually, I'm sorry, not main menu, home. We'll go to home, so we're going to go to Bluetooth. All right. I'll get my other phone out and I'll show another video on how to hook up the Bluetooth. But it's DDX3. And you got the iPod. Bluetooth. I knew somebody might have it up, so let's turn it down. Radio. We can't get a station to come in, there we go. Go back to home. Go back to Bluetooth. Because I'm using my phone to uh, record this video, I'm not able to go to, to the Bluetooth. But it is DDX3. When do you go to pair? The first thing we want to do when we get in the vehicle, go back to home. Go up here to settings. Go to systems, go down to Bluetooth setup, hit enter, and we're going to go see if there's anything already paired that we want to delete out. So we hit enter up here for paired device list. So we got three phones in there. What we want to do now is we want to highlight that phone, we want to remove it. Yes. Highlight Andrew's phone. Remove it. Yes. Come on. There we go. Jaden's phone. Remove it. Yes. You always want to clear out all the previous devices. It makes it easier to, to pair the next time. Alright. Go back to home. So what you're going to do is on your Bluetooth device, you're going to do a search for pair, new pair device and it's going to be DDX3. You'll hit pair then they'll come up and ask you if you want to pair on this screen and you'll pair on your phone and you're in. Pretty simple. Alright. This is a 10 passenger vehicle and just like up front with the driver they have a touch screen back here where they they can manip manipulate all the amenities themselves. So if they want to mess with the uh, temperature they're not happy with it then go right there and do the same thing we did up front. If you notice we were at 92, we dropped down to 82. This again is in the back for the for the uh, passengers to use. They got a laser on here. Which is in the floor. I guess it's better than being at eye level. Turn the laser off. Alright. 
car area. It is definitely getting cool in here now. Here's the bar area. The lighting. And then we'll slide down here. Here's the area I was telling you about. A little cubby. Put, I guess, maybe purses and stuff like that in there. opening to the driver's compartment and the back seats all right I'll step out That is X25. Ten passenger Dodge Charger Hellcat. And before we end this video, here's the iconic Hellcat logo. have a prom run today first after I pick them up we're heading downtown for pictures so then we'll head over to the moonlight pavilion at Coney Island for the prom don't forget to hit the like button smash a subscribe if you've not subscribed to the channel and leave a comment